This is the how-to video for Vivid Luster Factory's December 2021 ornament project kit. You will receive four ornaments and there are several shapes and sizes to choose from. Don't forget about customization so the design and colors can be exactly what you want them to be. You will receive two pieces of transfer paper, four ornaments, four pieces of ribbon, some glue and uh, alcohol wipe. You'll begin <laughs> with opening the alcohol light. Of course, this happens right off on what I was hoping was my last take. <laughs> and you're just gonna rip, rub, rub down the surfaces of all of the ornaments at once. And I've already got a piece of transfer paper in use here. And once I pulled it off of its paper backing, I did stick it to my shirt a couple of times just to allow it to pick up some lint, which will make the rest of this process maybe a smidge easier. I flip it over and I pull the paper off. And if the vinyl doesn't stick to the clear transfer sheet, then I just press it down wherever I need to. Okay, I'm going to place it onto the ornament wherever you would like it. Vivid Luster Factory DIY project kits are available for shipping. You can find us out at Crafts and Crafts workshops. We are also at the Bella Bottega Champagne and Chocolate Monthly event in Magnolia, Texas. We do private parties. If you've got a event coming up, I'd love to make a project just according to your theme. That would be a lot of fun for me. So you're gonna complete that process or repeat that process as you put the images you've chosen on the other three tile. Then when you're done with that, you'll flip the tiles over and you'll begin gluing the ribbons on. Now I included Super glue, not this for you guys because it would dry faster if you're making them somewhere that's not your house where you can leave them to dry for a long time. You're going to glue and you may wanna put glue between the two pieces of ribbon or right at the ends or put a dot and then place them down. I'm going to include a toothpick into the box so you can use that to move the glue around if you need to. I do recommend putting the hanger as close to the top of the ornament as you can. Um, moving it down further will make the ornament tip forward when hanging just a little bit. Alrighty, check us out at vividlusterfactory.com. We're on all the social medias as well, and we would love to hear what you would like to make next. Merry Christmas, everyone.